We wake up this morning at 645. We have got a gorgeous start to your Wednesday. Take a look at your screen right now. We've got some pinks and peaches on the horizon as we're waiting for our official sunrise time, which comes at 702 this morning, but quite a bit of color here early. One thing we won't see color on. Well, that's the radar as we expect things to be really dry again here, not only today, but as we wrap up the work week, even though we are going to see the moisture begin to increase, the humidity is up. When you step outside this morning, you'll notice it feels a little more muggy and that's going to keep our overnights a little warmer today though east to westerly wind will continue through the afternoon until we get later on in the evening where we'll see a weak sea breeze front kick in i'll show it to you on the uh, wind forecast in just a moment speaking of rain we need it we're over a half inch behind both in punta gorda and fort myers now for the year Fort Myers 0.61 behind since April the 1st. Winds are fairly light here early 5 to 10. They will begin to pick up later on this afternoon and you can see it gusting there 15 to 20 through the afternoon. By the time we get towards sunset, there's that sea breeze front kicking in. So along the coast especially, we will see the winds out of the west temporarily before they come light and variable overnight. And as you head out on the water today, no advisories, no cautions. Winds are going to be 5 to 10 knots basically out of the east until sunset. Inland waters there a light chop. Our temperatures are morning upper 50s we were able to fall down there along state road 29 low to mid 60s there along the coast but everyone is up about four to five degrees today is that transition from the drier air monday and tuesday to more humid air that especially will arrive here thursday into friday our dew point values are up in the low to mid 60s so we're going to call it tolerable on the humidity level but by the end of the week we'll be up here around 70 as things get a little more sticky our average high is up to 86 now the record on the state is 94 and we're forecasting to go right back up in the upper 80s and near 90 here today. And then overnight tonight, a little warmer. And that warmth is also surging across the mid sections of the country. Right now, it's warmer in St. Louis and warmer in Chicago than it is in Orlando. And that's all that warm air surging in ahead of the storm system, which is going to bring another round of severe weather for the upper Midwest today. That cold front that's attached to it, though, not going to impact us as we stay in the next couple of days. We're going to stay hot, dry, but a little more humid. Let me show you what it looks like in the seven day forecast here. Our temperatures don't budge in the afternoons. We'll be in the upper 80s to near 90. Overnights go from the mid 60s to around 70 all the way through the weekend into early next week.